we play. We fight. We conquer. Welcome back to the Freak Show. I am your host, Bumpy McSquiggums, and today we're diving back on into Fire Emblem. The Shadow Dragon and the Blade of Light. It is the OG, the original Fire Emblem that was released many, 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 many years after the original Fire Emblem was put out. And here we are getting to play it on the Nintendo Switch in all of its glory. First time released to us Western audience members officially. And yeah, I'm here for it. Got my hands on it. Super excited to continue playing. And obviously we're going with Marth. We're going to go with Draug. We're going to go with Gordon. We're going to go with Seda, Boris, Caster, Julian. They're all kind of kind of requirements, so to speak. Navare, I'd like to pull in. Merrick. And maybe Harden. He's our highest level guy, I think, next to Seda, maybe? Yeah, Seda is the highest level. Okay. Wait, who else is level 6? And Barst. Okay, so we're not going to bring Wolf or Sedgar, Rosha, Roshia, excuse me, Violand, Wendell we're bringing. Uh, I mean, we got left. I want to bring Kane. I want to bring Abel. Do, do we lose Kane? I want to bring Julian as well. There's why is Kane so far down? Is he just that low of a level? Did I, did I already select Julian? Where's Julian? Oh, I did. Oh, okay, don't worry, I got Julian. All right, all right, we we good. So basically, I got one more choice. So with Merrick, we have the mage, and we have Wendell also a mage. Needed to kind of get his inventory switched out, but. We don't really get that option right now. That kind of puts us in a, a, a weird position. And I say that because I'd like to get items off of the other folks. So, Riz, Riz, Riz whatever is going to come with us too. Only so I can get the thing off of him. Alright, let's take a look at what we're looking at here. Alright, lots of chests. I see a thief there. I see some mage match to command. I see a second thief. I see a third thief. Can we actually select these guys? Ah, Ricard. I bet he's a, a joiner. It looks like we can kind of prepare beforehand. So let's uh, let's just see what's around here. So Ricard probably joins us. Looks like everybody else is pretty much what you would expect. Just the, the basic Macedonian folk. Okay, we got a knight there. Got a mage there. Is anybody else further left? I don't think so. That dude looks scary. Looks like he's got a two-handed sword. Oh, we got like we got three thieves here. I don't know how I missed the three of them. Okay, thus far or thusly, if you wheel, not much is going on. I imagine the thieves are gonna make a mad dash for all of the treasure that's laying around. Which again, it makes sense. You know, absolutely, I get it. And Amarius. Okay. I get it. Yep, no, that's fine. Uh, let's get into it. Chapter 6, Fire Emblem. The rebels have made it into the castle. Impossible. Uh, well, we will show them, knights. Form up and rush the intruders. Archers, defend the throne. Thieves, loot the castle's treasures and prepare to withdraw. Hear me. Do not let them set one foot into this chamber. Not one! Yep, that's exactly what I was thinking too. I cure heal. Can I swap with you, buddy? If I go over here, maybe. Hmm. 
Where can we get Wendell to? There? Alright, let's put Wendell there. Oh, he's got a staff. What staff do you... Oh, you have the barrier staff. Okay, I gotcha, 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 gotcha. Alright, we're gonna hook you up with another one. Because that's how we roll. You got your, your magic spells that you can cast with a Z. And, uh... Items... Heal, trade. There it is. Uh, so I know there's a way to trade, and I forgot how to do it before. Okay. So, you're officially just garbage tier dog doo doo. Nobody cares about you. Alright. We got with you Iron Sword and a Lance with Kane, the lowest level individual. We got Harden, our high level individual, and we got Abel, also low. He's got the Rider's Bane, though, so that's good. I, I guess. I, I, don't, I don't really know. I, I can only assume it's good, probably. Seems like it's probably good. Alright. Can Julian make it? He can. Uh, master key, okay. The door opened. Now, d does... Do, do we need anyone specific to talk to him? Marth? Nope. Uh, maybe Seda? Oh, we can't. I was just going to go straight up over the wall, but apparently, no. That is not acceptable. Alright, well. Worst case, we exchange some blows thief on thief. Hopefully, that doesn't go poorly. It might. It's weird I can get onto the chest somehow. I'm cool with it. It's all good. Alright. Gold bars to get you up to the front lines, good sir. Yes, sir. I don't think anything is like in our immediate vicinity that I need to be completely worried about. Eh, there's a few guys. There's a few. I feel like that's the. Is there any other escape routes? Just basically our starting location and off to the east there. So if they do go to escape, and we can like hold this choke point, so when we can catch this guy, uh, I think we're gonna be fine. Navare, or Navar. Let's get you on over here. Uh, Marth. Okay, get you going too, buddy. You're still a little lower. Probably should be level 6 or 7 yourself right now. You're level 5. I mean, you're not that bad. But if we didn't get to that level in the last, uh, the last area, you'd be real bad shape right now. So, I'm okay with this. Alright, moving on. Hopefully Ricard wants to join us and does not want to be a jerky jerkwad of jerkitudinous, jerkitudinal, a T. But we'll see. We will. Sh we shall see. Oh, Gordon, why are you so far back, dude? You're gonna be so useless this whole match. You do not move fast, my friend. All right, let's end the turn. Let's see what happens. Okay, big boy coming over. Big boy number two coming over. We got the thieves out on their thievery missions, it looks like. Uh huh. We have a Kanite there. We've got a uh, thief coming over. It's fine. And another Kanite there. Or horseman, or whatever you want to call him. He didn't attack us, which has... I have a little bit of hope in my heart now. Alright, the healer stand, the big guy stand, the mage stand, and the double archers are stand. So, can Seda talk to him? Nope. Well, I mean... Can the other thief talk to the thief? Oh, he can. Oh, okay. What's up, Ricard? It can't be. What are you doing here? See what happened was, uh, Julian, it's been too long since I've seen you. Chief, uh, I came to this castle to steal a few things and wouldn't you know it, I got a little sloppy. And what brings you here? Me? Uh, as of today, I've washed my hands of thievery. I'm on the side of what's good and just. Heh, 
I bet I know the truth behind this change of heart. Beauties have always been your weak point. N not a chance. The, the spirit of justice awakened within me. Look, uh, don't worry about it. Just join up with us. There you go again, trying to make up my mind for me. Since you're the one asking, well, why not? It's settled. I'll lend you a hand. But I'll take a cut of the loot as payment. Alright, well, now we've doubled our thief capacity. We have a Ricard the Thief. Well, good job, I guess. Alright, Seda, you got a lot of ground to catch up, girl. Also, you gotta avoid getting shot by arrows, because that's gonna be just absolutely the worst. Alright. And you guys are just gonna have to forgive the, the little bloop bloops. Ooh, how do I do this without risking a lot? What do I have on a silver sword? I can't use it. Yeah, that's right. Because we're trashed here. Because we be trash. Alright. I, be oops, I believe caster. Nope. Don't want to be there. Ah, you know what? I do want to be there. I changed my mind. I should win this fight? I did. I did win the fight. Excellent. Okay, what kind of weapon do you have? I just want to make sure I don't, like, overdo it. A lance. Okay. So what if... Are you hardened? No. You're hardened, right? Nope. Dang it. It must be you. There we are. We're going to put you in front of our boy. I'm going to wait. Got to get good old Lord Marthington the, the first over here. And I suppose Navarre can come hang out. Our mage is within striking distance. Not there yet. Ugh, it's going to be a long, slow process for a lot of our crew. They are not fast boys. Some of them are. I mean, most of them are pretty quick. But some of them just not super fast. Unfortunately. Hopefully we can get the brothers, Kane and Abel, up to a decent level. I mean, we, we have so much that we got to do. Right now, this is kind of my, my ghost squad. This is my forward uh, advancement squad. And I like pretty much all the characters, but there's a lot that needs to be done. And we are quite behind on many of them. Like, Gordon's not even going to be able to see combat this time around. I'll leave the matchstick alone. Alright. End the turn. Is the big guy going to move? I don't think he is. He might. Well, those big guys are going to move no matter what. That, that's kind of a gimme. And yeah, there's the thief. Treasure stolen. Yep. I think that thief might even be able to make it. Yep. I don't think we can cut... Oh, he wasn't able to do it. Interesting. Ooh, he did move out. That's kind of unfortunate. Yeah, you know, it is what it is. Yeah, go ahead, attack Martha as well. I'm down with it. Alright, so here's my current thought process. Like to take you down with our boy. Uh, I'm going to say the steel sword, probably good enough. Perfect. He could have just crit off the top, but you know what? It's cool. Navarre has taken him down. I'm a little more concerned about this one. There's no real healing that can be had here, so this is a little bit off-putting, but we're going to try it. Got the follow-up. We got the, not the kill, but we got the, the damage out there. I think Abel probably strong enough to finish what was started here. I really hope this is the case. Attack. The iron sword should be enough. Right, what we have to do is hit for like three, right? Yeah, and that's literally all we hit for. Oh, that's rough. Alright, that's fine. 
Because I want you, my friend. I want you to go up here. You're going to go chase down that thief. And while you're here, you're going to slap this guy upside his noggin. Like, boop! Right to the dome piece. Boom. Not quite enough to finish him, but you know what? I'm, I'm cool with it. And he's, he's basically maxed out his experience, but did not quite gain a level there. I think Martha's feeling okay at this point. Doesn't really run into too many issues. Iron Sword's coming out. I'm gonna bonk this guy. Not enough to finish. It's kind of surprising. Not gonna lie. Alright, gonna go ahead and attack you with some Blizzard. Boop! Boop! Ooh, not, not enough. Oh, okay. That was um, not what I was expecting, if I'm being honest. You got enough, Wendell? Oh, you do, my friend. Oh, you do, buddy. Hit him with that thunder. You know that's going to hurt. It's going to hurt him. Look, look, look. Still unimpressive, I know. But our guys are real low level right now. Our mage-type folk. Super underwhelming on the level side of things. So, like, I get it. Seda doesn't really need more love right now. Um, I guess Kane can maybe go for the kill. Okay, he hit for seven. That's good. I was a little worried. The last time we only hit for three, I'm like, oh, he's got more than three HP. I don't know about this. I don't know about this. Alright, Bars is taking a frontline position. Seda may have to help run down some fools. I don't know if that's going to work. She doesn't seem to have... The, well, I mean, the beauty of what she can usually do is flying over walls and just kind of avoiding chaos and just not having to really like maneuver around. She can just go straight out, right? So that is going to be negated a little bit. Now, the good news... I think it's good news. I could be completely wrong here, but... The thief that made it up to the top that we're going to be chasing down here in a minute didn't open the box yet, so I think he's stuck staying there for at least one more round before he can do anything. What level is Ricard? Wait, what? Do I, hold on. Do I have to go literally on the chest? The chest contained 10,000 gold. Ooh. Or, or gill, or gold de plumes. You guys like de plumes or de blooms? Maybe de blooms. Um, some other interesting monetary measurements that my brain's not working and bringing up. I thought you needed keys for the chests. Maybe thieves just have that inherently built in. I don't know. All right, let's see what happens. We'll end the turn. I feel relatively safe with our crew. I don't think a lot of terrible is going to happen. I'll say Bars is going to eat a shot here. I don't think it's going to hurt too bad. It hurt a little bit. It hurt a little bit. But he also struck back in a pretty substantial way. I'm not going to lie. It was mildly impressive. Okay, so he stole the, the treasure now. Uh, Navar should be fine. Dodge, my friend. He did not dodge. Oh, those counterattacks are weak sauce. And he's just like, nope. He's peacing out. He doesn't want anything to do with anything else. Alright, you're going for the treasure. Was the mage coming down? Mage did not move. Alright, unfortunately, we're going to have to do this once again. I apologize, guys and gals. So I'm here, the little popping and clickling in my ear. I must, uh,. I must stop that. Well, you know, I, I don't think Seda's needed up here anymore. I've definitely cut this guy off. He can't get past me. Alright, so he got the double. That's, that's cool. And we got the level. Skill, max HP, and weapon level, maybe? I'm not entirely certain what went down there. Alright. So, let's do this. Let's do it the other way. I think I'm going to use Excalibur. Probably a mistake, but maybe not. What do we got? 
Okay. Just a one hit. Could have done that with anything. I forgot how much damage we actually did to that guy with Barst. That was... That was kind of... Unnecessary. There's a risk. The mage comes over to play. How much health do you have? Uh... Okay, we hit him, he hit us back. It wasn't great, we got a level up out of it, level 7 skill, goes up by 1 weapon level speed and HP. Alright, let's hit you with some thunder, my friend. Bit of underwhelming. Does the does the rapier do damage to knights? I feel like it does. But I'm not sure. I don't I don't really know. I'm gonna give it a shot. Oh it does. Okay, okay. Like in my mind I'm like, I'm pretty sure it, it's against knights that it does well. Even though logically it doesn't make I mean it kind of makes sense you can stab between the plates of armor or whatever like th there's there's ways of justifying it making sense like I get that but yeah generally speaking we do enough oh absolutely nicely done very nicely done caster leveled up to six strength going up by uno skill and max HP I don't really have an elegant solution to this guy, though. Navarra is not feeling good. Mm. Well, let's see if we can land the attack. Oh, we did it! Nice. Alright, we took you down. Level up 4, weapon level acquired, speed and max HP. We didn't get any loot from it though. I thought if we killed the thief we would get loot. Apparently that's not how this works. Does she have anything that she can... She got the armor slayer. Oh, well then, excuse me. I'm going to handle business right now. If you'll, if you'll just sit back and enjoy. Bye! Oh, less impressive than I thought. Still, I mean, we obliterated them. There's nothing to really get upset about on that front. I think I go there safely-ish. Alright, our thieves are going to come over. I mean, again, not much that they can do in this situation. Still so much risk to literally everyone. Our heavily armored individual at risk from the spellcaster. Our low-B uh, horse rider dudes at risk from just a lot of different things. Uh, you know. There's some spookums times coming. And Gordon is trying his darndest to get into a position to where he can actually be useful. Let's hope he finds it. Alright. What you got? Well, they're going to get up into that other chest for sure. I say there's no question there. He's fleeing. He's going to get a heal. That's his goal right now. He's not going to make it. Okay. Marth? Okay, Marth's going to eat it. Not that big of a deal either. Like it was, it was fine that he ate that. So much so that I feel like I could probably just attack him and be fine. Boom, boom, 
And boom. All right, down he goes. Marth's going to get a big chunk of experience for that. 32. Pushed him to the very limit, but not over. Uh... Hmm, hold on. Can Barst catch that guy? He cannot. I don't think you can either. Nope. So is it only Wendell? Maybe the mage? The mage can catch him. Alright. Attack. We're gonna go with a Blizzard. Again, we got to get some level ups. It's unfortunate he had one HP, but hey, you know what? It's all good. All right, I feel like, oops, I feel like right now, what makes the most sense is throw a heal onto Marth, just to make sure Marth stays fully ready to go and hopefully not ready to die. A little concerned sending Barst into this. Does he have a throwing axe? He does. Hand axe. Go ahead and chuck it at him. That's our safe, safe haven there. Got the single attack off. I'm cool with that. that that's there's no problems there. I suppose it doesn't matter which direction I head. They're both pretty much the same. We're down to the last few folk, so it's a bit weird. I'm a little concerned for Navar. Like, he could definitely get hurt. But perhaps if we wait there. How healthy are you? You're fully healthy. Put you there. Come back over here. Do another quick one of those to get rid of that annoying, clicky, crackly sound. Ugh. Well, I. Oh, I can do the javelin over the wall, or through the wall. Okay, I'll take it. Hold this. Good job, Abel, or Abel. Captain Hardeen, get on over here, buddy. You can wait if you want to. You can leave your friends behind. No, it's uh, something different. All right. Attack of the bow. Might. Would. Should be enough if it hits. It did. It did hit. 42. Another big chunk of experience coming our way. Very good. Yeah, I kind of debated what I wanted to do for my last recording of this day. And I kind of went back and forth in my mind like a thousand times. And I'm like, you know what? Let's do some Fire Emblem. When in doubt, go to one of those things that you really like. I, I've been also really craving. And I'm not sure I'm going to get back to it right away. But it's on the list. Really craving playing um, Shining Force 2, like a lot. So definitely look to see that coming back into the rotation soon. I may try and may endeavor to finish up a Fire Emblem game before I do that. Not real sure. But again, I, I'm now at the point where wherever my whims take me, I think I'm going to go there. I'm just going to follow it. I'm going to try to keep this as fun as as possible for the old the old Bumpington, the old the old man. Wrong button. The old man bumpy, and we're going to try to keep it as fun as possible. I enjoy what I do. If I enjoy it even more, what's the downside to it, right? So I'll still keep up doing new content, of course, and new games that come out that come my way that I'm interested in. I'll cover them. However, um, aside from that, I'm just going to go with what I feel like playing. Just enjoy it. I, I feel like that is probably the right way to do things. And I'm here for it. Hmm. I think Marth's going to get some more level ups down in this area. I don't think I'm going to... Maybe Wendell? Maybe, maybe we give it to Wendell. No, you know, Wendell's got enough that he can do. He He's okay. I don't need Wendell or Merrick to get that free kill there. Definitely don't need Seda to get it. I think Draug's okay too at level 5. So it's really going to be like Kane, Abel, maybe one of the rogues, one of the little thiefy boys themselves. Ricard's level 1, Julian's level 3. Uh, even Gordon wouldn't be a terrible choice because, again, he's been struggling this whole time to catch up with the crew, and he finally has. 
Barst is a bit banged up. I'm going to try to keep Barst as safe as I can. Mm, Caster's doing fine. He's level 6. He's a little bit banged up too, but I, I don't think there's a problem there. And as we as we stated, Seda just has to make sure she doesn't get shot in the face with an arrow or in the side of the Pegasus. And she'll be okay. Navarre could technically use the love, but eh, I think I'll skip that one. And Kane is like maxed out, but did not level. So let's go ahead and do that one. I feel like it's just a, it's a quick, easy, guaranteed level up if we can kill him. And we did. So. Yep, there we go. Uh, skill goes up by one, weapon level, speed, and HP. It was a pretty good level up for him. No real qualms or complaints about it. Alright, get you on to the next area. Little concerned for Ricard, but all things can all things considered, and I know not every level up has like HP gains and whatnot. He's got 16 HP, our level three has only got 17. That's a one point increase. Not necessarily the greatest. And we'll roll over here, we'll roll down this way, and we golden. Should be breaking off the episode right here, and perhaps we will. Sort of want to finish this one up, but, you know, I get it. I feel like we're one kill away from getting the music switch, so... I suppose, yeah, I suppose we'll end it here. In the next episode, we'll finish off the remaining five. Uh, not positive, pretty sure he's not going to move, but he may. And we should be able to obliterate these guys. What is he using? That looks like an armor slayer, maybe. Silver sword, okay. So that's some dangerous damage coming out there. Definitely want to be able to obliterate him in like one move, not give him a chance to survive. So either way, folks, I'm going to break it off right here. In the next episode, as I said, we will continue our adventures. We'll go through, you know, one other thing that wouldn't necessarily be the worst idea of all time. Maybe sending down our matchstick man to check out the store. I mean, we didn't look at the shop at all, so it might not be a bad plan for the next episode. Anyway, folks, until then, I've been your host, Bumpy McSquiggums. Thank you so much for stopping by the Freak Show. And always remember, we play, we fight, we conquer.